In Bolivina Catal, my children, this is uh, Dr. T welcoming you to the second session of our Talanoa about our uh, birds in Fiji. Or Manu Manu Buka, this is the second part. And today we'll be learning five uh, new birds that I would like you to learn and appreciate. So I'm greeting all the children from all over the world, uh, wherever you are, as well as those of you uh, logging in from Fiji. I hope that you will all enjoy uh, the learning all about Fijian birds. Greeting everyone, children from the Confederacy of Kumbuna, um, Burumbasanga and Tobata. I sincerely hope that you are well and I look forward to having you enjoy this class with me and learning more about five other birds that we can learn and appreciate. These are the five birds. The first one is Kulawai. Kulawai. Second is Ketenromo. Ketenromo. The third is Kikau. Kikau. Fourth is Tambandamu. Tambandamu. And number five is Sobau. Sobau. So let's start with our class. So can anyone tell me what is the name of this bird? Isn't it beautiful? I'm not sure whether anyone, anyone has seen this bird um, in the village or behind the house. Or maybe you must have seen it online too. Hmm. If you know the name of this bird, write it down in your book. Isn't it pretty beautiful and pretty? Now the name of this bird is... Kulawai. So at this moment I would like to acknowledge uh, Dr. Dick Watling uh, for allowing uh, Marangetiviti or Nature Fiji uh, to use uh, the images from his book Birds of Fiji so we can all be here today learning about this beautiful bird. So it's the, the name is Kulawai in Fijian but it's known as Red-Throated Loriquet in English. So let's learn a little bit more about this bird. So the red-throated loriquet um, is actually critically endangered. So what does that mean? That means that we don't see them a lot anymore. So the, uh, the only last time that it was seen was in 1993. And um, so the ornithologists who are the uh, specialists of birds or scientists that study birds, they've been looking for this bird for a long time. Now, apparently, based on the research by Nature, uh, Nature Fiji or Margetiviti, they mentioned that the Nandaribatu Monasavu area was where the Kulawai bird was best known to be found. But since 1993, there's hardly been any of it seen around Fiji. So the only place they can um, see the Kulawai is the island of Taiwuni. So the team um, at Nature Fiji by Nunia Moko, they're working really hard. Yeah, so we'd like to acknowledge Nunia and her team for working hard to look for the Kulawai. So they're on the Kulawai search, looking for it and traveling to Taviuni. So for any children listening in from Taviuni, keep an eye out for any Kulawai bird that you may see. And if you see one, Make sure you contact Nunia Moko at the Nature Fiji office in Suba. You can contact them through their Facebook page. You can also see a picture of the Kulawai bird on the $5 bill. This is our second bird. Now, does anyone know the name? If you do, you can write it down in your book. Isn't it pretty? Now, this is the second bird that we're learning today, and you want to know the name? For those of you who don't know, <gasps> ready? It's Ketan Romo. Ketan Romo. Again, acknowledging um, Dr. Dick Watling for allowing us to uh, use his book, Birds of Fiji, um, and also to Nature Fiji for the use of their. Uh, cards, playing cards. 
so we can learn more about it. Now the picture here, it actually shows the female Ketendromo and the male Ketendromo. So let's see more and learn about this bird. Now this bird also has a name called Ndimbesau and in English it's called Fijian Whistler. So it's only endemic to Fiji, so it can only be seen here in Fiji. Um, how to differentiate the gender of the Ketendromo? So the male has a bright yellow underside and the female has a dull brownish gray color. So you can see here, that's how you differentiate. Okay, the female and the male cat and robber. And this is our third bird. Does anyone know? Hmm, it's got a very long beak. Okay, and look at those claws. And look at those furs. And feathers. Does anyone know? If you know the name, write it down in your book. If you don't know, you ready with your pen and paper? Right. This is our third bird, Kikau, Kikau, or known as the Fiji Wattled Honey Eater. It has other names like Kaisau, Kaisevau, or Kito, and it's uh, regionally endemic, which means that you can also see them in Tonga, in Samoa, and New Caledonia. So that's how you can see the description. So it's olive green with a small orange wattled, surrounded by black so this a little round um orange color just below uh it's around the around the neck yeah it's below the eye and um it's quite aggressive and noisy and it feeds on nectar insects and small lizards so that's our third bird everybody say kikau kikau this is our fourth bird Ooh, isn't that beautiful has anyone seen this bird before? Let's look at this bird. You ready for the name? Drum roll. Tambandamu. Tambandamu. In some places they call it Songe or Rube. It's endemic to Fiji and it's uh, found in uh, uh, remote rainforests. Uh, it's called imperial fruit pigeon in english imperial fruit pigeon and it has a deep dog like buck and okay, that's the sound it makes when it cries or when it communicates um, in the province of namosi there are tribes that um, has the tambandamu as its totem bird so they really really treasure this bird so this is our fourth bird tamba dam and this is our fifth bird. Does anyone know? Hmm, I wonder what the name is. Okay, you ready with your pen and paper? Sobao. Sobao. In some places in Fiji, they call it Iko or Dabu Dabu Iwalu. Iko or Dabu Dabu Iwalu. It's endemic to Fiji and it's 27 centimeters uh, in length from the tip of its beak to the tip of its Okay, so it's got a curved uh, bill and that's the color of its feathers and it's um, similar but not exactly the same as the um, giant honey eater from Taviuni. So Taviuni has uh, its own uniqueness in terms of birds that are uh, seen uh, or special um, leaf found on the island of Taviuni. So wow so much to be celebrated uh, on the island of Taveuni and we hope that uh, we can see the Kulawai bird again and uh, also find more of the Sovau birds over there. Nakabakalewu for joining me on this uh, second series of the Manumonobuka uh, Talano session. Nakabakalewu to Nature Fiji or Marangeti Viti um, for enabling me to have this session. Dolly Super Bird Watching for beautiful images, Google Photos, and uh, Ron Getty for uh, extra information for us to use today. So if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please do, please uh, subscribe as mom and dad, uh, as I will be posting more videos in weeks to come. Thank you for joining me. Appreciating the time of my family for helping me, Leo, for editing the video. 
uh, Kali for helping me with my research and uh, Merwe Rita for uh, marketing um, these uh, videos um, to many of you young ones to see uh, via social media. Nakavakalevo from all of us. Until next time, Lisa Mwadimanda.